Hey guys, in this video, I will be teaching you a very easy SMC trading strategy. Actually, I don't like those people who overcomplicate their trading strategies. First of all, it's uh, it's not good for your psychology. If you're just overcomplicating your strategy, you are adding a lot of things and you know mixing up everything and just yeah. So just don't do that. Just stick with simple things, and I guarantee you you're going to become profitable so i've seen a lot of people using the smc strategy and they do it all wrong okay and then they ask this question why does this thing not work why it doesn't work right so i have a very simple um answer for you you suck at identifying liquidity okay you suck at identifying liquidity or accumulation phase and this is what I'm going to teach you in this video, how you can identify legit liquidity, okay, the one that is actually important, and how you use break of structure plus liquidity and auto block to take your entry or supply or demand zones. Auto block is basically just supply and demand zone. So let's assume that. So first of all, for this strategy for SMC. Um, you want to identify market structure okay and we are only going to use one time frame for this strategy okay you don't want to drop down yes of course you can for confirmation entries but it is not necessary you just stick to one time frame which is one hour time frame okay or you could stick to four hour if you want to but just stick to one hour okay so you look at the chart and if the market is creating high high right high low and higher high higher low higher high you are going to trade in that direction and similarly if price is making lower 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 high lower 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 high you're going to trade in that direction regardless of what anyone says or what thoughts come to your mind just trade with the trend okay now what a lot of people do is that when they have a break of structure for example they have a break of structure here right and there is no liquidity so you mark out your ob let me mark the ob out so you have your auto block here right or demand zone whatever you want to call it and you have your buy limit set here now what happens price comes back to your poi gives a small reaction and then it pushes back down now the reasoning behind that is you did not identify liquidity or accumulation phase okay so what you really want to see here is that some sort of consolidation here before price comes in back into your POI okay you're gonna have some sort of consolidation here you can have something like this now that is way too much consolidation okay but if you see this right a, some, a little bit of con consolidation then that poi becomes valid okay so you have a consolidation or one would say accumulation phase right here right and after that what you want to see is price come back to your poi and then push back up again and create another higher high so we have accumulation manipulation which is right here okay and then we have distribution so you got to stick with the trend and follow these follow this rule where you have to you must identify liquidity okay this is must by liquidity i mean consolidation it doesn't have to be equal highs right equal lows right something like this no it doesn't have to be perfect you just want to identify this pattern right here a consolidation phase yes it could be equal highs could be a resistance or a support level but this is a must when you have a break of structure once again right and let's assume that you have again a break of structure like this right so you have a small pullback and then you have a break of structure now if you are going to take your entry from this you must see price create some sort of consolidation here right and then come back into your poi and yes you can take your entry from here again then right but what if 
let me delete this um, when price tapped into your older POI before breaking the structure price created some sort of consolidation and then it pushed back up right and you have what I would say another break of structure something like that so you consider this as a break of structure here as well now the question that I'm gonna ask you is from where are you going to take your entry you will not have any liquidity build here for uh, for this example but you have liquidity here around here and you have a POI around here so even though you had a break of structure here you have higher high higher low higher high but price doesn't create liquidity here okay what it does is it goes directly into your POI it goes down right so without creating liquidity here so you will not take your entry from this auto block right here no this is wrong absolutely wrong okay you look at the liquidity you identify the consolidation phase something like that right and even though price has went back and had another break of structure what you can do is you can take your entry from this level and when it comes back you're gonna have a beautiful move to the upside it's really that simple guys okay so yeah make sure you because I have seen a lot of people what they do is they skip this step and then they ask themselves why is this thing not working at all so here is an example number one as you can see we are bullish right we have a bullish market structure so we're gonna trade with the trend okay we have a break of structure here you see price broke the structure and after that you want to see a liquidity build or a accumulation phase An accumulation phase is when a consolidation happens what is consolidation it could be a support level or it could be a resistance level or both so in this example you can see you have a support level you, you had a push up price came back to the same level had a little push and here we have we had a push down price came back failed to break through this level and then it's, it pushed back down and we also have a trend line liquidity okay so this is must you must identify clear liquidity okay the one that you should look and say yo this is what retail traders are going to trade okay now what is a fake liquidity for me this right here okay a small structure or even this this right here right no this is not yes they could be considered liquidity but if you really want to like increase the win rate just identify structures like these okay consolidation or um a trend line or something like that and i do not consider this as liquidity here as well yes for other strategies i can but um for smc and specifically on when we are trading on a one odd time frame only one time frame i look at this okay so right here we had an auto block and price pushed back up again so now what we have is a break of structure once again you can see price broke through the structure this high and now what you do is you identify um so first of all very important you mark out your um the fibonacci and see if there's any auto block below the 0 0.5 level yes of course there is and after that what we had uh, sorry so before price came back into this auto block or demand zone we, you see that we have this liquidity right so this could be considered as equal lows right or a support level and we don't have much consolidation yes you can consider this as consolidation as well right around here and before price came back into this auto block what we have is another beautiful build of liquidity and this right here is what I what I can actually consider consolidation right and after that we have a manipulation beautiful beautiful entry here and just look at that move so this is what I am trying to teach you you must identify clear liquidity because liquidity guys nothing works okay this right here you can see we had equal lows 
or a support level and that was beautiful okay so you must learn to train your eyes to see structures like this okay and then we have another break of structure right here right so we mark out our auto block here we have a small consolidation here right price came back filled this auto block and this little fair value gap and if we had a good push up here but then we have a beautiful consolidation phase right here so let me mark this out you can see we have a consolidation phase here uh, we have a build of liquidity as well i would call this a support level liquidity and we have this beautiful level price went back down tapped into this level and then we have a beautiful break of structure right here and after that what we had was a market structure shift for smc strategy and you could then maybe look for um short positions but right here i can tell you that we probably lost this trade because we had a break of structure here right and then we have a consolidation phase you can see right here then we have an auto block here but then price just shot through this level so i hope what you get what i'm trying to say um i want you guys to back test this stick to one time frame and yeah you should be good guys so i hope you like this video if you did make sure you hit the subscribe button and i'll see you guys in the next video